The Syracuse Mets look to be on cruise control tonight for the majority of the ball game heading into the ninth inning, up by two runs. That was until the Charlotte Knights came back with their bats and also some good vision at the plate to beat the Mets 9-8 in 10 innings tonight here at ABT Bank Stadium. The Mets had won three of their last four games, and tonight looks like another promising effort until Mets right-handed pitcher Grant Hartwick came into the ballgame and walked in two runs in the ninth to tie the game, and Charlotte would take it the rest of the way. Mets manager Dick Scott notes the costly mistake from Hartwig to start the ninth. Uh, I think the big thing with Grant, and he already knows this, is like you gotta just, he's got to throw more strikes there, and, he, and he's trying. Uh, but, you know, the difference of being in AAA in the major leagues is being able to command your pitches. And that's that's not a statement against Grant. That's just a, a fact. You can't walk the leadoff guy. Like, you got to make him put the ball in play. And, and then they blooped the ball into right field, which I think frustrated Grant because he made a good pitch. Uh, we lost the ball in the lights in right field. Uh, but then there were two more walks after that. And we just got to, you know, he got a, he got a strikeout, had a chance to maybe you know, get out of that, but it just didn't go our way tonight. I was happy the way we got it back. We had the winning run at the plate in the uh, bottom of the 10th, and uh, just didn't go our way tonight. After Syracuse came up empty in the bottom half of the ninth inning with a chance to walk it off, Charlotte took advantage and plated two runs in the top half of the 10th. Syracuse came up just short by scoring only one run in the bottom half of the 10th inning. Syracuse hasn't had the best success as of late, only 15 and 35 since the later stretch of July. Also, their bullpen is bottom 10 in AAA with an above 6 ERA. Good news for the Mets. They can rebound tomorrow night right here at MBT Bank Stadium with a 635 first pitch against the Charlotte Knights. Reporting from MBT Bank Stadium here in Syracuse, Nico Horning, Citrus TV.